Hey everybody, it's Rick with Stumps, and I'm back playing more Flame in the Flood. Day 5. To be honest with you, I can't quite remember what was on this island, but I'm willing to bet probably dangerous things. Oh yeah, we've got snakes. That's right, there were snakes on this island. So I'm going to say sayonara to this island, and we're going to cruise down the river a little more and see if we can't find some stuff. Looks like our food, our hydration, our sleep, all that stuff looks pretty good. So I think we're in good shape to start rolling down, or rather, drifting down the river. And we've got a church here, but we've got a camp over here, too. I, I kind of want to go check out the camp if I can get over there. There we go. Current's working with us, thankfully. Whoa! I almost spoke too soon. It almost pulled me right out of there. Land lock. Light on supplies. Well, that's fine. As long as it's a safe place to rest, I'll be happy. Let's just go. Of course it's not. Of course there's friggin' wolves. And they're chowing down on something. There's a bloody mess there. Uh, I kind of think maybe I should just try to sneak around these guys. I'm gonna... Oh, they heard me! That is something that can happen. They can hear me sneaking through stuff. Okay, never mind. Uh, not worth it. Not worth it! I said it last episode. We need to get a bow and arrow or something to take care of these wolves. I know that we can get bows and arrows, obviously. I mean, those feral kids that gave us a point of stick or a uh, whatever they called it. Point is something. They talked funny. But we can make stuff to combat those guys. At the very least, we can make, like, poison meat and poison the stupid wolves. But, oh god! Ah, that sucks. We're gonna need to repair this boat soon. Oh. All in all, I haven't taken a lot of damage to the boat, though. I think we've been pretty lucky in that regard. And we just got some wrath schematics, which is pretty great. What have we got here? Fish hook. All right, cool. There's a camp coming up. Let's stop at the camp. Hopefully, it won't be ripe with wolves. And we'll be able to get our bearings. Because we need to make some stuff, clear out some space in our inventory. I think we're pretty full up. Taysan Soldier's Path. Often has flint, always has a lit fire. Cool. That is awesome to know. And it's got a bunch of cattail, too. Can make a bunch of corded rope while we're here. See if they got some rabbits, too. Maybe we'll be able to catch some rabbits or something. Oh... Uh. Just going to do a quick sweep of the area and make sure there's no wolves waiting to chew our faces off. Are there any wolves here? I don't hear any howling. And that's a good sign. Okay, there's that fire that's always lit. Oh, there's a boar. I wonder if the boars are afraid of the fire. They are. Cool. So no matter what, if we stay within the radius of the fire, we're going to be good. Get back. Get back. You hate fire. Oh. Oh, he's on to us. This guy seems smarter than the wolf was last time. All right, we're just going to ignore him for the moment and look through our bag. Let's see what we've got. All right. Uh, first off, let's go to our inventory and see what can we make. We can make a spear trap. Ooh, suitable killing mid-size game. I'd call a boar mid-size game, wouldn't you? I feel like we should make one of these and try to catch this boar. I think that could be fun. And let's see. There's a, Okay, there's our spear trap. Wait, I don't, I don't want to fill the jar. There we go. I want to use this spear trap. Let's set it up over here, and then we'll sort of try to tease this boar over to us. There we go. All right. Let's see. How, how do we position it, first off? I think I'm going to have to tiptoe a little bit farther out. Come on. There we go. Okay. So here we are. Let's try to spear this son of a gun, all right? Putting it down. We're going to be eating boar tonight, baby. Boar tonight. And now we're going to get him to come over here and come on. Come on, boar. Let's go, buddy. Come on. Come at me. Come on. Come on. Is he so smart that he knows that I put a trap here? Is that what's going on? Come on. Come on, bro. Don't you break my leg. Come on. Okay. Oh! Oh, damn! Damn! Okay, that works! Right on! We caught ourselves a boar, and we've got raw meat and boar hide. Sweet! Let's cook some meat. Shall we? Let's use this fire. And we're going to... Oh. Sit. That's right. Sit at the fire, and we'll do a little bit of cooking. 
Cooked meat. Super duper. And, ooh, I can make penicillin. I can make a wrap frame. I can make a stitching kit. I don't need to make any of those things right now. But we've cooked some meat, and let's see. What do we got on us? We've got nuts and bolts. We've got raft schematics. Oh, speaking of the nuts and bolts, I can use those to make raft upgrade things, I believe, too. Because this episode, I would really love to upgrade our raft if we could. Let's just see here. Where is that? Raft hardware. Here it is. So I need a stone hammer. I still don't have a stone hammer. That is hard to believe. Oh, that's right. I couldn't find rags last time, right? Stupid rags. Okay, so that's actually what we need to do first. We need to find some rags. And now that we've killed this boar, maybe we can go searching around here and find some rags. Wouldn't that be cool? Wouldn't that be nice? Well, we've got old lumber. That's not a rag, but we'll use it eventually. We've got some flint, but I don't have room for that flint. Oh, well. I think there was another box over here. Was there not? No, there wasn't. Come on, Aesop. Wild garlic. And over here... Okay, we got the bus. Yep, aloe vera. Mulberries. Come on, rags. Ah, no rags. All right, well, we got to hit the dusty trail. The dusty trail or the rapids, whatever you want to call it. In search of some rags. Maybe hit up a gas station? Gas station should have rags, right? I feel like maybe. Maybe, possibly. And there seems to be... Okay, that's a... Uh, yeah, it looks like a gas station 150 meters down. Let's see if I can get to it. Oh, ill-equipped. It must be getting cold. I need to get some warmer stuff. Oh, it's going to start raining, too. Time to find some shelter. Ooh, we're going to make it. We're going to make it. We're going to make it. Yes! Source of gas, workbenches, rags. Rags, guys. Lumber and hardware. Which would be great so long as we don't get eaten alive. Make sure that there's no dumb animals around here. Okay, so far the place looks clear. Ooh, there's a quest box. That's rad. Now I've got wet. That's just great. Pout Smith. Gonna create a pouch. Ooh, we've got some rabbit holes. That's good. We can camp out here for a while. Fill up some rabbit. We're going to definitely need to take shelter, though. Let's go see if there's a place to do that. It would be swell if there was. But maybe not. Holy moly, what is... Who is this? Hello? Okay, you're kind of creepy. Magnolia, are you? Oh, hello, Magnolia. What'd she say? Need some grub, stranger? Got some rabbit left. Already ate my feel. Most obliged, I say. Ain't always so nice, but I had me this dream the other night. Saw my mama, clear as day, young and fair. Told me I ought to be more avuncular and munificent. Already done broke bread with you. Want I should share some learning? Yeah. Share some learning. What are we going to learn today? You get snake bit? Brew up some dandelion tea. Sumac tea's best for stomach bugs. Them plants got magnesium in them. Finest thing. Kind thanks. Ain't nothing to it. Wow, I thought she was going to be creepy with all those skulls and whatnot, but she was actually mighty kind. Okay, let's go see if we can find some rags. And I'm getting drenched. I'm not going to worry too much about it, though, right now, because there are tons of skeletons here. What's she doing? She said she hasn't been always so kind. I wonder if she killed all those people. Do you think that she killed all of those people? That would be kind of terrifying. But you know, it's my lucky day because she's had a change of heart. She saw her mom in a dream. She has to be more magnificent or whatever the hell she said. Uh, I don't think that those words meant the things that she thinks they mean. But then again, maybe my vocabulary just isn't as great as I think it is. Okay, it said that there's usually rags here. So come on, give me the damn rags, will you? Give me the damn rags. There's no place to go to bed here. The least you can do is give me some damn rags, huh? Okay, good. The rain's stopping. That's a good thing. Because I'm going to need to sleep soon, and I have not found any friggin' rags. All I found was magnolia over there, and... Oh, oh, there's a box right here. There's a couple boxes. 
I guess that was just hard for me to see in that pounding rain. Come on, rags, rags, rags. Yes! Ooh, ooh, my inventory's full, but we'll clear out some room. No big deal. We're gonna go ahead and eat that meat. That's what we're gonna do. Because we can consume this. That should give us 50. No, 30. Okay, good enough. Rag. Finally, we've got a rag. Which means that we can make our stone hammer freaking finally and finish that quest that we should have finished ages ago. Uh, wait, why is it not showing up? Where's stone hammer? Oh, I need a freaking sapling now? Where did the sapling go? I thought I could have sworn I had a sapling. If it's not one thing, it's another. Okay, that's a sapling, right? Perfect. Friggin' inventory's full. All right, what are we going to eat this time? We're, oh, we could just can move uh, the boar hide down to Aesop. That's what we're going to do there. Take the sapling. Now we're going to make our freaking hammer. Yes! It only took four episodes, but finally we've got our freaking hammer made. Oh, and apparently I'm skinning this dead rabbit too. Which is fine by me because we're going to need to cook that rabbit eventually. Now let's check this cache and we're going to collect... Oh, we're going to collect a campfire. That's the reward for finally making our hammer... But once again, I need room, so we're going to move this raw meat. Aesop, hold that raw meat and do not eat it, okay? I know you. You're a dog. You want to do things like that. And the task about the pouch, right? Let's see what I need to make a pouch. Because I've got a stitching kit. And... Or I can make a stitching kit, rather. So if I can make another pouch, that's actually going to be pretty handy. Here we go, pouch. Oh yeah, I just need one stitching kit. That's totally doable. Oh no, oh, I'm getting cold now. Okay, um, but I got that fire, right? So I can set it up and get warm. So let's do that. Let's set up that fire. Let's see, where are you? There we go, campfire, deploy. Build that fire. Fantastic, okay. Fire's lit. We can cook that rabbit now. And let's go ahead and sit by the fire. Right now, we're already getting warm. This is good, good, good. That fire came at just the right time. Here we go. Cooked meat. That's what we're going to make. And our wet's cured because we got all nice and dry. All right, we're, we're getting the hang of this now. We are getting the hang of this. And what do we got in our inventory here? We're going to move this cooked meat now to Aesop. And we're going to make that stitching kit. Which means that we're going to now make the pouch. Wait, why is pouch not on here? Come on. Oh, I need two rabbit hide. Son of a gun. I only have one. Okay, well, if we wait till day, we'll be able to uh, catch us some rabbits. Because there are rabbit holes over here. And it looks like the night cycle is just about over. Daytime has come. Time to... Oh, we've got corn in the raft. I can make corn cakes. Let's do that. Corn cakes will... be a good thing to have. Let's go do a little switcheroo at the raft. A little switcheroo here. Here we go. Wait, no, no, no. No! Don't get on the raft, dummy. Okay, whatever. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, well. Mistakes happen. That's fine. We need to go find a place to rest anyway. We actually got quite a bit done there. I'm sure that we can find another place that has rabbits. Which will let us get one more rabbit pelt to make the pouch. Important thing is we found a rag. We finally made our stone hammer. Which means that we can make those raft parts and upgrade our raft. That's going to need to happen. Is, what is, is it getting rainy again? It's getting too stormy because it's broad daylight right now and it is super dark and creepy. We've got a campsite coming up and yep, there's the rain. And we've got a shop as well. Which one do I want to go to? Okay, let's hit up the shop first because that is closest. Oh god, these rapids are pretty tough. And I think this is a liquor store. 
Dirty D's. Gross. All right, that's a gross name. But maybe they'll have some good places to rest and get dry. Oh, actually, yes, here's a place to get dry. Fantastic. And while it's raining right now, I should fill my jar. Perfect. Jar's full because we're going to sleep and we're going to need to let's sleep for uh, five hours. That should get us fully rested. When we wake up, we'll drink that water. Hopefully, the rain will have stopped. It has. I love it. Fantastic. Well, it's still sprinkling a little bit, but it's almost stopped. And we can drink that water now. Let's do that. Cool, clean water. So, even though the rain has stopped, the sound of the rain is still going, and poor little Scout here thinks it's still raining. So what we're going to have to do is uh, quit and come back real quick. This happens. This happens with this game. And I have the private build of this game that they gave us before the game launched. So maybe they've actually fixed this in the uh, final build. But this is something that's happened before. The sound effects just sort of stick around. I'm back. The rain has stopped and so has the sound. So we're good to go. Let's go examine this quilt. Let's see what this one says. The quilt of Big John Boar. We've, we've read about the quilt of Big John Boar. Apparently that's a popular thing around these parts. People, they love their quilts of Big John Boar. And here is the liquor store. It's probably got some alcohol, but ooh, it's got some jerky. My inventory is still real full. I need to make one of those pouches, but I need some rabbit skin to do that. So let's just do a clean sweep of this area and see if there are any rabbits around. Oh, because I restarted, I need to drink that water again. There we go. Glad I remembered to do that. I don't want to get dehydrated. That's the worst thing you can do. You got to remember to drink, guys. I think you can go something like seven days without eating, but you can only go a couple without drinking. It's important to drink your water. Stay hydrated, okay? And we'll take that salt because we've already got some that we can just stack. And what do we got here? We've got some alcohol, but can't fit any alcohol in my inventory right now. I don't think we're going to luck out and get any rabbits around here. So we're just going to need to hit that river again. It's all right, though. We're going to find some good stuff. I have a feeling. Got a good feeling. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Well, oh, God. Way to go, Scout. Driving like a maniac. I can't wait till I get a motor for this thing. And I'll be able to fight the current. But right now, not so much. Speaking of motors, where's there an upgrade station? I feel like it's about that time that we try to upgrade. Or at least repair. And that'll kill two birds with one stone. We'll be able to clear some space in our inventory. Oh god, it's going to start raining again? It is so rainy right now. Yeah, here it is. Ill-equipped. Once again. Got to get warmer clothes. So that's something that we're going to have to do by the time we play this game again. Okay, we've got another gas station coming up. About 200 meters to my left there. And we've got a fishing village as well. Gas station, though. That's where it's at. Let's go to that gas station. Hopefully, they'll have rabbits, maybe? Oh, it says Magnolias. We were just at Magnolias. Hudson Petroleum. Source of gas, work benches, rags. Okay, we, know, we know the shtick. We know what to find at pump stations. Let's see if we can find... Oh, there's a wolf. Okay. Oh, did I hear a snake too? This place has wolves and snakes. No, thank you. No, thank you. We've entered hill country. Deep country with few docks. This is region 4 of 10, so we've almost reached the halfway point. But few docks. Uh, that doesn't bode well. Which means that we can't be choosy about where we dock. Because we may not get a lot of options around here. Hopefully one of those docks will be a marina because we need to upgrade our little raft here. Oh, there's a star. This is something totally new. What does a star mean? Oh, I have a feeling that this is something important. A star, 150 meters. The river is going so slow right now, by the way. I am hardly moving at all. This is the slowest I think I've moved yet. A star, a star. Oh, it's a dam. 
Oh, that's why I'm going so slow. That it. Oh, wow. Okay. So we have to dock here. And there's a radio tower. <gasps> Surging River Solitude. Light on supplies. But is this where that signal was coming from? Danger high voltage. This is exciting. Exciting stuff is happening. There's a fire. <gasps> a bearded friend. Visit Flim Flam. Hello, Flim Flam. Fair weather, stranger. You strike me the kind appreciates barter. Flim Flam's the name. Equitable trades, my game. Pardon this little roadblock. Be glad to spring it right open for a small favor. What's the favor, Flim Flam? Thing is, I need to be in two places at once. Been trying to power up an old radio transmitter to spread word of my fair deals. I gotta mine things down here while somebody throws that switch up top. You game to be that very person? Where's the switch, Flim Flam? Glad to hear you're on board. Run up the hill behind me. Throw the switch at the top. Make sure everything spins up okay. Do that very thing. I'll get the river cleared up for you. Simple enough. Sure is. Be on your way in no time. I'm right straight shooter. You'll see. Flim Flam. Honest as the day is long. Some tells me that's not true. I mean, his name is Flim Flam. That in itself just screams dishonest. At best, dis dishonest. But... What choice do we have? We're going to go up here. We're going to flip the switch for Flim Flam. Oh my god, those rocks are falling. This thing is teetering dangerously close to the edge. There might not be like snakes or wolves or anything crazy up here. Just high voltage. Okay. Wait. Do you think he wants me to flip this because it's super dangerous to do so? Uh. Oh god. Okay, well. Wait, my radio. Let's, let's hit it. Don't be electrocuted! Transmitter's on. Oh! Please proceed to Angel Yards for evacuation. <gasps> Goal completed. Radio signal. Finally, we've figured out the radio signal. All right. And we've got a new goal to get to Angel Yards. Man, I'm really glad that we actually got some stuff done today's episode. Learned how to kill boars. Met a couple new friends. Well, if you want to call Flim Flam a friend, I guess we're going to because we're so short on people to meet these days. Uh, but we've got a fire here. We've got a box over there as well that we can turn in our quest. Actually, let's do that right now. Let's go ahead and turn in our quest. Get... Oh, new task. We've got churchgoer, whatever that means. Probably means we've got to get to a church. And we've got a raft schematic for completing the quest. So that means next quest, or next next episode, rather, uh, so long as we can get to a marina, I think that we'll be able to upgrade the raft, no problem. And then we'll find some rabbits so we can complete that pouch quest as well. But things are really coming together. Now that we know how to make those spike traps, it's a game changer. We can kill these stupid animals. What I really need, though, is a bow and arrow. So hopefully we can get that done very shortly, too. We're making progress, guys. And I hope you guys are enjoying this ser series as much as I am. I'm really enjoying the Flame of the Flood. If you are, please give it a like, favorite, share, and subscribe. Go ahead and give me your guys' comments below. I love reading them. And come back next time when we'll be playing more. Blame the flood. I'll see you all then.